Hey kids, today's show is brought to you by the letter 4 and the number potato! I'm a stupid private. Hey Pony fan, welcome to another one of my rambling analysis videos. Today I'm looking at technology in Equestria. The word of the day is anachronism. Can you say anachronism? Anachronism? There, I knew you could. Now pay up. Seriously, light bulb, what are you gonna spend it on? In My Little Pony, there are a lot of out of place or anachronistic items, like Pinkie Pie's microwave or Twy's Big Room O Science, that I don't think are really reflective of Equestria's true level of technological development. And even there, there are some real peaks and valleys. Let's start with military tech. Huh. If Celestia's propaganda is to be believed, Equestria is a peaceful place, and as a result, their military technology isn't that sophisticated. But there is an actual military. The only weapon I've ever really seen the Royal Guards carrying are spears. But they do have solid metal armor, so I put Equestria's military technology at the medieval level. Transportation. Here, Equestria is much more advanced. The ponies have access to everything from trains to airships. Rail seems to be the second most common form of transportation in Equestria. Right behind good old-fashioned horsepower. Airships, though, are mostly the playthings of the idle rich. I doubt they're very necessary, as one-third of the populace is capable of unassisted flight. The motor force behind all these machines is steam. No internal combustion engines here. Equestria's transportation technology is around the 19th century. Entertainment. Ponies obviously have access to the wonders of electricity, and they use it to power fun toys like reel-to-reel -reel projectors and turntables. We've also seen bowling alleys and pinball machines. This is one of the most advanced areas of equestrian technology. I'd say they're around the 1970s. Medical technology. When ponies get sick, they go to the doctor. And to help them get well, there's all kinds of helpful medical gadgets like x-ray machines and medication. But there's no evidence of anything nearly as sophisticated as an MRI, and if you were able to read the back of that pill bottle, I doubt it has anything more than aspirin in it. So I'd say Equestria's medical technology is around the 1950s. Communications. This is another fairly draconian field of development. The only way to send a message in Equestria is a hand, sorry, hoof written letter. Granted, if you've got a good pair of wings, or better yet, a magical dragon, those letters are going to get where they're going pretty darn quick. But that has nothing to do with technology, now does it? I'd say Equestria's communications are stuck in the 1800s. Private, if you say the words Pony Express, you're doing push-ups. Agriculture. This is sort of a tough one. We see Big Mac with a plow, but then there's that steam shovel looking whoozy what's its Private, I find your mastery of technical vernacular to be very impressive. It seems that most farm equipment in Equestria uses, well, horsepower. So I'd say agriculture in Equestria is around the early 1900s technology-wise. So as you can see, technology-wise, MLP is sort of all over the map. But if you drop off the major outlier of military technology, I think we can pretty safely say that Equestria's technology level is around the early 20th century. And to make myself sound smart, I'm going to say the exact year of 1908. If you wanted to sound smart, you should have picked a better screen name. Thanks for watching. I'm the Stupid Private. That's all, folks.